Hey everyone, Amber here from Cream Yarn, long time no see. I know it's been a while since I've done an update video, so without further ado, let's jump right in. Since my last update video, things in the world have gone a little bit crazy, a little bit weird. Uh, we are, well most of us are practicing self-isolation, social distancing, we're quarantining, uh, we're buying way more toilet paper for our assholes due to uh, COVID-19. And since then, a lot of art and music shows have been canceled and or postponed, leaving a lot of creatives a little bit lost. Right now, the art community is trying to figure out how to exist. So if you have a friend, uh, if you know, fa if you have a friend, if you have family or know of any creatives who need help, uh, here are some great ways to help them out. One, buy their artwork and buy their merch. Like any other business, if you buy stuff from them, it will help them. Two, share their websites uh, and repost their artwork with their permission or make sure you at least tag their handle in it so people can go to, um, to the artist's page. Um, three, watch their streams, uh, watch videos that they post on YouTube, that they have on Twitch. Some people monetize things, so that little bit of revenue can help out uh, greatly. Uh, it all helps, it all helps keep the economy going and it helps keep the art culture going. And, you know, I myself, I've been affected by this as well with most of the events that were planned uh, being canceled and or postponed until an unknown date. Uh, I was actually, this year, I don't know if you guys watched any or followed me on Instagram. If you don't, you should. Uh, but I kind of announced it late last year that I was going to do a creamy art tour, which I already had, you know, multiple events booked up and around and then everything happened and all of them got canceled so it was a bit of a drag um, but you know you learn how to adapt and you keep going and you figure out different ways to bring your audience what they love and what they like uh, so let me just share a few of my current projects that I am working on besides the daily art creations that you can find on my website and on Instagram uh, first things first, I am bringing back my old creative online magazine slash blog. I used to, when I first started out, I used to, um, it wasn't just like the artwork or my artwork. I used to highlight my friends, uh, my creative friends, uh, people that I met, people that I worked with, and just kind of gave them a shout out, gave, you know, just the whole works. Uh, so, and I was... I was unable to continue to do that just because I didn't have enough knowledge, I didn't have enough experience, and I wasn't around long enough in the art world and in the music world to actually be able to provide my friends a better service and to really get people to look at their work. So I have to work on myself and I'm really excited to be able to bring this part of Creamy Art back to light. and. Um, it, it it just it makes me happy like it actually it makes me happy so I'm just really excited to be able to continue this project I started so many years ago uh, we also have a few editorial photo shoots that will be I'm not, I guess you could say editorial um, uh, photo shoots that will be happening later this year uh, I actually got asked to be a model of a photo shoot so I'm excited about that we're kind of I can't really say the details as to what it is um, but it's gonna be pretty pretty nifty I could say so I've been talking to the photographer we've been kind of working things out so look uh, I look forward to that and creamy art will be doing our first editorial photo shoot for that will coincide with the online uh, blog slash magazine so look out for that and the big thing that everyone asks for and which is a yearly event that we host um, is Ido Ido art and music show <sighs> it, 
it kind of pains me to talk about this just because everything is up in the air. This is my baby. This would be the third year that we're doing it, especially after coming off of 2019. Last year's show was awesome. It was, it was fantastic. But this year, I'm not sure. Uh, I'm, I'm really not sure about how the event is going to go because on one end, people are booking, you know, they're booking their events for later this year but that's not even guaranteed that things will be okay by later this year or that will probably get worse by you know by the same by later this year in like what six months so as far as like the show it is kind of up in the air but we do have a plan B so I don't want you to worry about that we do have a plan B I just need to make sure that I have uh, some creatives and bands that will be willing to participate just because it is going to be something completely new that I haven't seen anyone do before and yeah it's I, I'm, 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 I'm thrilled I'm thrilled about this I know I'm using the word excited and thrilled a lot in this video but these projects are they're big. They're big for me. So I, I can't wait. And um, yeah, last but not least, let's talk about the new items to hit the shop. I'm always experimenting with new um, mediums and new methods of creation. So I do put some of those experiments up on my shop from time to time. And I'm also working or trying to work with some other creatives so we can uh, collab and I could put some items in my shop like that we collabed on so that's kind of in the works um, but I'm I'm always working on artwork I always have stuff for sale so it would be awesome if you did me a great huge favor stop by my shop purchase some artwork it helps me a lot it helps me keep creamy art going and it helps me keep um, it'll it'll go in all of this stuff so it'd be awesome if you stop by my shop to purchase some of my artwork and I'm I'll, uh, and speaking of the shops I'm actually really really stoked about uh, this next topic let's talk about the t-shirts so if you follow me on Instagram you've probably seen a sneak peek of the shirts I'm also wearing uh, one of the sweatshirts right now it's raining and it's cold and this sweatshirt is really warm and awesome. It's like super soft and fuzzy inside. The color is really nice. Uh, this sweatshirt will be available in, I think I have like white, uh, no, I think I have like gray and black and white that these color, that this sweatshirt will be available in. Um, but due to this, I'm sorry, I was like reading, but due to this human event, uh, we did have to cancel the photo shoot that we were going to have uh, for the new shirt line. So my husband and I are going to have to do it DIY, old school style, do it our, you know, kind of do everything ourselves. Um, so expect the t-shirts in a couple of weeks. Uh, it, it's awesome. I can't wait. And uh, that's it for now. Thanks for watching, thanks for supporting, and don't forget to enter my giveaway on Instagram. You'll be so silly not to enter this giveaway. You're just winning a whole bunch of free art for literally liking a post and following someone. How hard is that? So stay safe, stay indoors, help your neighbors, keep that PMA up, and I will catch you guys next time. Peace.